PBAS and PBASI measuring systems are the ideal solutions for the final quality control of bottled beverages directly out of glass bottles, PET bottles, or cans. The main measuring parameters are obtained simultaneously without prior sample preparation. While PBAS is commonly in use for the analysis of sugared soft drinks and sparkling water, PBASI is able to provide additional information about the sugar inversion process of the sample. To prepare your PBA system for routine analysis, please make sure you have all the required equipment handy. For your own safety, please wear protective clothing, safety goggles, and ear protection. Turn on the device and set the supply pressure to 6 bar. Please prepare your sample for transfer. To do so, shake your sample horizontally for about 15 times to properly establish equilibrium between the CO2 and O2 content of the headspace and the liquid. For PET bottles, please install the adapter on the piercing and filling device. Cans need to be placed upside down. Glass bottles can be inserted as they are. For proper sample transfer, the filling device needs to be adapted according to the sample container. For cans and glass bottles, adjust the height so that the ring disappears under the piercing head. For PET bottles, lift up the handle and just insert the bottle into the adapter. PET bottles need to hang in the piercing and filling device without touching the ground. Close the safety shield and pull the lever towards you in order to apply pressure. Now the container is pierced and you can lower the filling tube. Please secure its position to be ready for the sample transfer. In order to validate the performance of your setup, perform a water check every day, in the morning, or before starting the routine analysis, before each shift. To do so, use distilled and CO2-free water and activate the sample transfer. Select Water Check and follow the instructions on the screen. While the water check is in progress, you can easily check the CO2 current pressure and the sample volume. The pressure shown during filling has to be at least 5 bar, and the sample volume should be at least between 120 and 150 milliliters for a PBA SSI system in its basic configuration. For each additional measuring module, about 20 milliliters extra need to be added. The instrument will automatically present a report at the end of the water check. Even if the water check has failed, the instrument will tell you. If the pressure is too low, the sample volume is not enough for your configuration, or the water check should fail, please refer to the instruction manual. The sample is prepared for the transfer. Now select the appropriate method, depending on the sample type which is going to be measured. Once the method is selected, you are ready to start the measurement cycle. The sample is transferred automatically from the container to all measuring cells. While filling, gas bubbles should not be continuously visible in the hoses. In case there are, please see the instruction manual for further steps. As soon as the automatic filling procedure is completed, the PBA system will start the measurement sequence of all devices. The Carbo QCME performs the multiple volume expansion to measure the real dissolved CO2 content without being influenced by the presence of nitrogen or oxygen in the filled sample, while density, bricks, pH, and dissolved oxygen are measured simultaneously. 
After three to five minutes, the entire measuring cycle is completed. To remove the container after your measurement is done, raise the filling tube, release the pressure, and open the safety shield. Lift the handle to easily remove the container. In case you are going to change the package type for the next measurement cycle, you might need to change the height as well. In case you are not using your PBA system for more than 15 minutes, please fill distilled CO2-free water either by starting a measurement or by the service utility called Rinse. For daily cleaning, insert a bottle of distilled CO2-free water instead of your sample. Select Clean to start the automatic process. After about two or three minutes, stop the process again. In case the analysis is stopped overnight for any reason, deactivate the pressure. Now the PBA system is clean and ready for the next measuring cycle.